AECOM, and our professionals are committed to working with FEMA to develop new and innovative solutions to further the science of hazard mitigation and improve FEMA processes and products. The AECOM team has worked closely with FEMA over the past year to develop innovative and scalable approaches to assist states and local communities with projects aimed to make infrastructure more disaster resistant. Since time does not allow our entire team to meet with you today, we put together this video so some of our AECOM family members who will be committed to the HIMTAP program can let you know what working for FEMA means to them. My main background is instructional design. I had the knowledge and the skills to understand blast mitigation, uh, progressive collapse, and evaluating uh, forensic studies of existing buildings and as well as new building design. My biggest asset to the team will be the relationships that I have and not just with FEMA and the FEMA regions but with the folks in the communities who um, need to be using this software, who need to be um, involved in mitigation. Really my biggest asset is that I can walk into a room like like an American Indian reservation with a community that's never heard of mitigation, explain it to them, help them understand that value, really get the technical jargon down to a level where folks understand it and they embrace it. And I think I, I've had tremendous success with that. That's something I'm very proud of. It's what I like to do. I really believe in this work. When, when there was a flood up in, uh, on the St. John's River and way up in, in northern Maine last year uh, on the Canadian border. Well, the, re the, the regional manager, the state emergency manager and the regional administrator, our Cleves at the time, needed information right away on, on specific facilities that were associated with that flooding. Well, we were able to return those maps around. They took them out there. They brought them to the town. They were prepared for the storm. They knew where their, where their uh, critical facilities were that could be impacted by this event, and it worked. FEMA has become one of AECOM's most rewarding clients. What we're talking about here is a way of being able to provide the client with a tool and data and services that live on by themselves and not just you do it once and then in 10 years you've got to do it all over again. You've got to start from scratch. You've got to make that data so that it lives and it breathes and that you know that it's out there and you're able to manage it from year to year. And that is one of the focuses I think a project like HEMTAP should really have is to be able to focus on providing data up front, but then using that data time and time again to, 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 to really get uh, a good hold of it and not have a throwaway project, but one that lives on for eternity, essentially. Our people, who have worked on HEMTAP and other FEMA programs, believe in FEMA's mission and are proud to be a part of working with FEMA to fulfill its mission. I've worked for a long time uh, in this arena where I have a very good understanding of New England, of the FEMA Region 1, and of the issues that are important in this region. And it would be gratifying for me to be able to, to use that combination that I've been working for all these years for to, to come to a good conclusion and really help, help the region and help solve some of these problems that, that the HEMTAP contract would address. While I was attending the University of Florida, this is about the time Hurricane Opal hit in 1995, I became very interested in the questions that came after in terms of redevelopment and loss reduction. I went down to the local emergency manager's office in Alachua County, Florida, uh, down into a little basement, and found the local emergency manager. His name was Craig Fugate, and uh, he's the new current FEMA administrator. Uh, and at the time, I just wanted to volunteer and get involved with some of Alachua County's local hazard mitigation efforts, which were uh, getting off the ground. So I worked with Craig closely on the National Flood Insurance Program, promoting the community rating system, uh, getting out working with the local municipalities in Alachua County uh, over the course of the next three years.